Welcome back. The Goa MLAs finally corrected their mistake by wearing helmets on Friday. The MLAs yet again rode to assembly complex as passionate bikers. Last week, they had violated traffic rules by not wearing helmets and some bikers were not having proper number plates. The MLAs say they regret the last Friday incident. It is proof that nobody is above the law. No authority will be spared for acting against the rules. This time the MLAs learnt a lesson that rules and regulations are spared for none. The MLAs were seen with good conduct. All the MLAs rode their bikes, strictly obeyed the traffic rules. It was our mistake the last time when we came without helmets. So this time we have all made it a point to come with helmets. helmets. Because it's a clear indication that nobody is above the rule. And we are the lawmakers, so we can't break the law. So this time we made it a point that we will come with helmets. And one thing is, we want to make it very clear to the riders. Wear the helmet for your own safety and not to show off to anybody. I am taking issue the law regarding the helmets. For which, if we have broken the law, we have paid the fines. So I don't think that should be an issue for us to ride bikes as MLAs. I think helmets are not the third bike in glass and mirror. I think they don't bike in mirror. No, they as per their particular things. I think all the bikes today have come with proper regulations. Last week, the Chief Minister assured the House that the lawbreaker MLAs would be penalised. However, the episode will be used constructively to propagate a positive message among the masses. Archbishop has raised concern of safety of CCP's proposed Bainini garbage treatment plan. Newly elected CC, uh, CCP Mayor Surendra Futardo discussed the issue with the Archbishop. Futardo has assured world-class garbage treatment project at this site. However, Archbishop has raised concerns. Proposed garbage site at Bainini is close to World Heritage Site. Some religious institutions have opposed the plant, fearing that plant would attract diseases. When you talk about the garbage, I said, uh, Your Grace, the land given by the High Court and the Government of Goa and Bainini, we are having a lot of hurdles. I want you to bless me by speaking to the church in Old Goa. Uh, then he was a little bit upset. He said, You have only one place that is in the heritage zone. As it is, we are having problem with the World Heritage Centre and very soon if this thing goes, then we will lose our World Heritage Centre certificate. So he told me that you, I am not against it. I said I will try to put a world class um, uh, plant. He said, you know what happened in Japan? This, uh, you might be here today, you might not be tomorrow. The punch, you can't you can assure. And uh, heritage will be in doldrums. Uh, Old Goa. The next day is the uh, exposition. So I told him I'll speak to the chief minister and come to a consensus to see what we can do, one for North Goa, one for South Goa. Surendra Furtado met the governor on Friday and requested him to assist in getting JNRUM fund from the center for CCP. Fund will take care of CCP's various infrastructural projects. CCP has raised tax and license fees of houses and commercial complexes. Furtado says it is just 10% high compared to last two decades. There's nothing left for us until and unless the people of Panjim um, strengthen our hand. Only 10%. Nothing else. 10% will be not a big thing. Reporter Mahesh Ghadi with video journalist Sushant Pal for Prudent. Principal Sessions Court judge has convicted Tanadhan Konkri. He has been held guilty for burning Dilip Naik inside his vehicle in year 2011. It was alleged that Janardhan burned Dilip in his car to claim the LIC policy money. Dilip's family is gratified by the justice to their family. Point of sentence is on 17th of April. Janadhar Konkre had brutally murdered one Dilip Naik and burnt him in his Tata Sumo car in Mole. This incident happened in the year 2011. District and Sessions Court on Friday held Janadhan guilty in this case. It was the case of the prosecution that the accused separated the head from the body, cut both the arms below the elbow level 
and both the legs below the knee level by using a sharp edged weapon which was locally known as satur and through these parts of the body by the left side of the highway road while traveling towards ponda thereafter the accused person dropped this headless body in his jeep at barkate on the kacha road and on the right side of the highway and set this his own vehicle on fire along with the headless body with the intention to destroy the evidence and thereafter absconded from the scene dilip naik was murdered and burnt in the vehicle to destroy evidence dilip naik was mentally unsound guys aja bhag tene fason ho raha aja ba mentally mas hai ta ka fason ho raha ta jo amanu satya ke liye ta ka jodan marlo ani दाखल दाखन दिल कि आप एल आई सी पॉलिसी के लिए तो लाखानी पॉलिस के लिए सगले तेजो डाव आसो भावक ये कर मेवपा आज तेजे सगले फसले आ कोर्टान आज निकाल दिल्लो आज भावक आज हमें फेमिली जस्टिस मेले आ रिपोर्टर समीर भट फॉर प्रूडेंट government will introduce spot billing for electricity consumers within 3 months to let consumers would be covered under the system power minister milin naik assured that consumers would get regular bills once the system is in place he was answering a question raised by mla pramod savant chief minister manohar parikar assured to keep business at electricity offices open on weekends to facilitate bill payment दर महीन कारण प्रत्येक लोकांक सामून सामून थकले तीन महीने आता ना एक फुड़ा तीन महीने जो रेगुलर ये विषय क्लियर करो सुकर सर एक एश्योरस श्योर दिता कि विद इन दीस फ्यू डेज से स्पॉट बिलिंग चालू जाते कमीत कमी एक तीन महीने जाए एवरी मंथ नी पोन दोन महीन पर रेगुलर आफ्टर थ्री मंथ आफ्टर थ्री मंथ ये काम चालू जो दोन महीन तरी बिल सारी रेगुलर जी पैला राउंड एक स सत महीने वोतक सारे रेगुलर जा स्पीकर से तेजी महीन महीन घी बिल हाँ जर ते दोन दोन महीन पर क्या विचार करता जब तुम्हें स्पॉट बिल घता सर जब तुम्हें महीन महीन घया एक गवर्नमेंट तो रेवेन्यू ही तुम्हें डिले करता सर घर जो बैकलॉग आते कवर कर स्पॉट बिलिंग घरान सुधा थोड़ा वे वो नहीं फिर एक विचार चालू आता तो शनिवार आयतारा सुधा बिल कलेक्ट कर इलेक्ट्रीक डिपार्टमेंट ओपन दौर ये सदर्भान एक ना गावानी गांवी हाँ क्रेडिट सोसायटीज आसा पे खूब सोसायटी आसा प्रॉब्लम ती एक एक फारीक करना डिपार्टमेंटा ट्रा ट्रांसफर करिना तो प्रॉब्लम आ फाइनेशियल करता डिपार्टमेंटान व्यवस्था करता शनिवार आयतारा घपी गांवान सुधा डिपार्टमेंटा ऑफिस आसता न